welcome back to the channel what's good i'm kiva so a quick mini update it's been about two weeks since i uploaded a video um my work has changed a little bit and i have not been able like by the time i sit down and like get like my planner is there like by the time i get my planner and be ready to, to give y'all my planner be ready to do my where's my money going i'm tired however i have been uploading on my main channel um because honestly it's a monetized channel and when it's monetized it's income so you do post more over there but i would like to get this channel monetized so you need to upload over here right okay what a conundrum but anywho's i made a goal to get 200 dollars in a month in my um, savings account and i did that it's been there untouched for a month exactly now my goal was 16 dollars a day because i was supposed to be out doing uber eats doing any one of my apps once a day for sure getting 16 dollars. i have not done i did and i have not finished that then i spent the money that i had saved um emergency came up i used my emergency money it was there i gotta stop beating myself up for going into my emergency funds but when i go into my emergency funds i gotta devise a plan to start putting that money back in the same breath i have to not beat myself up for not getting the money back up to where it was fast as i did okay life happens but you don't quit quitting saving. You don't be like, fuck it, I, you know. No, okay. You did. That's what an emergency fund is there for. You need it, you spend it, right? Okay. But sometimes it can get discouraging because you're like, damn, my account all the way back down to zero. It's discouraging to see, but it's to me, again, my opinion, how I run my household and my thought process to let it stay zero and complain about it when, just like I bought Starbucks today, seven bucks. That seven dollars should have went into my savings, right? Yes, but that's neither here nor there. But you get what I'm saying. So again, little things like that. And that's how I got back to that $200. And, and to not have touched it and I actually need it for a few things but i can i can finagle and do a little something different to to take care of something else a few other things a few other things i need to take care of then i'm going to do that um i want to also say and this is just my thoughts when you have a win like that and you save x amount of dollars no matter how small even if you like girl i got 50 dollars in my account i've been holding on to it for six months even if you never put another dollar in it, but you left that 50 there. And I say that because everybody's budget is different. I don't speak for nobody else's budget. We don't know how hard it is for some families just to get $50 put up and not touch it. I used to say things like celebrate the small wins. And then I said, why belittle that win? Why, why do we have to make a win small? Why can't a win just be a win? Celebrate that win. Like, I'm celebrating that that $200 is sitting there. It's, it was, it's hard to leave it. God damn it. Some bitch. But it's there. And I'm not going to say, oh, I'm celebrating my small win. I fuck that. That's the big win over here in this household. Okay? It's struggle. It's staring at me. It's taunting me. It's calling me. Spin me. <laughs> Press on. Oh, my God. <laughs> y'all know how i feel about my lashes and my press -ons. oh thanks it jesus um but i buy press ones out of my own money i don't touch that you know so i just want to just encourage you if you have a win let that win be your win and you can't share every win with some people because you share a win with people now this is social media people will come in your comments and say whatever the fuck they want to say because they ain't got no motherfucking home training they uncouth okay so they just come in your comments and talk they shit but your inner circle the people you really fuck with you know what i'm saying be um i'm sorry use discernment as to what can you share as a win because you will also notice them backhanded compliments 
them sideways compliments oh good you got two hundred dollars but you know just remember if you if you do this you can get five i didn't ask you how i can get 500 bitch i said that has two hundred dollars that's what i said i didn't ask you for extra advice on how to double it i just said i had the two and i want you to say good job girl we all honey if we can keep keep it going sis come on but you'll get that one friend like if you had to just did this I, if i don't ask you for advice i don't need it social media is different you put something on social media everybody come in your comments with the extras and some are coming from a good place because maybe they just think you don't know or maybe they just feel what they have to say is relevant or maybe they just are just being a bitch and want to just make you feel away because you didn't achieve what they feel you should achieve because some people will look at people's budgeting videos or side gig income videos or whatever they say and feel oh they can do this with their money i don't this social i've been doing social media before youtube i don't the shit don't bother me you say what you want but excuse me my apologies um make sure when you when you have your wins and you're telling them to somebody that means something to you that they will celebrate with you in a genuine way and they're genuinely happy for you and not just w w savings just wins in life general do you know how many wins you can have just in life first of all waking up is the win we in a pandemic if we waking up to even cut on our youtube to watch somebody you're winning if your phone is still on you're winning <laughs> okay we're having wins all the times okay but celebrate them and not make them out to be a small win you know and don't let nobody take your joy for your win it's your win you know you did that no matter what it is if you was like i didn't eat out all month i didn't go to no fast food restaurants i cook and here's the thing about not eating out cooking when you really cook and i don't mean heating up your hot pockets i don't mean heating up a tv dinner i mean thawing out some meat or whatever you eat tofu whatever getting your product your your meals the prepping the seasoning the cooking the waiting the putting it up in the proper containers to save it so it's good to eat the next day for two three days the packing of the lunch you have to make time for that and when we have our busy schedules it's a struggle to oh, i didn't make my lunch to go in that kitchen you be ready to go to bed you done took your bath y'all those of us who get it we get it even people without kids sometimes they said kiva it's just hard to get in there and go cook a whole meal you know so what i have tried to do is i try to cook up two different meats whether it's two three pounds of ground beef and just freeze it or whether it's a bunch of drumsticks or a bunch of chicken wings cook them you know bake them or from however you cook them and then freeze them and then you can just thaw the meat out and make you some sides whatever you have to do to make yourself have a win at something have your win celebrate your win because now isn't the time to let anybody take your joy take your thunder take anything from you that is bringing you a peace of mind and a little bit of organization to your life look at other people's lives to to get inspiration never to copy never to duplicate never to fake it off as your own but be inspired at what you see when i watch other people's videos whether it's gigging you know how they do their side hustles how they're planning their budgets and i look at i can't i'm drawing a blank on y'all name but y'all do battle of the budgets um several people have done it so it's it's not just one in particular but i've seen three or four maybe even five of you guys do it i love those because i see inspiration for something that i could do but i also recognize that's not my household that's not my income that's not what what would work for me i'm gonna wrap up this video but the point is celebrate any win that you have and whatever your goal was and 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 stand stand proud in it because you did it you know what i'm saying 
Um, and if somebody gives you, a, like I said, a backhanded compliment or try to be slick talking, pay attention to that. You ain't necessarily got to quit being a friend, but pay attention to that and then act accordingly and watch what you say. That's it for this video. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it if you stayed around for a video. It's awesome. <clears throat> If you're OG, you've been around for the long haul. Hey, welcome back. I appreciate you. I love everybody to come through and catch a video with me. Thank you so much. So that's it for my update. Your girl is sitting tight on $200. Help me. Help me. Help you to help me not touch. <laughs> Y'all, I'm out. Thank you. Bye.